Hello everyone and I'm excited about this video because I want to show you a few things that I've been working on pretty pretty hard on. Uh, so the first thing is I've been trying to craft this Regal Fletching um, I'm not sure what this is, crossbow and uh, it has these really nice bonuses. The only problem is it costs 75 million of silver and you need all of these purples you need uh, basically at least six of each so you need so this is what I have I have the the great boxes is what I have uh, crafted already and these are is what I have um, sorry the great boxes never mind so yeah everything with an X is what I have already so I'm good so I have one of each of the eternal blaze eternal howl and, and the butcher I have one of each I have an X there so as you can see I have one of each now I just need, I'm halfway there, and I will need uh, two more ash cleavers, I need six, I need, sorry, two more of the blazing sun blades, so let's look at, uh, let's see, eternal howl, I need one, so I have one already, the butcher, and to make one eternal howl, if you look at the eternal howl, this one here, I need uh, one foe slayer, um, I need one bloody messenger and four heart piercers just to make one of these so and I just need to make one because I already have the other one so I have the eternal hell I have one made already so I already I already crafted four heart piercers as you can see one two three four already crafted I already crafted um, one foe slayer just to make this, but you also need full layers for other stuff. Um, it was kind of charts, kind of complicated, but this is just, just to help me track it of what I have made. Um, I will need so for this ash cleaver to make one ash cleaver, you need one of each of these purple uh, pieces of equipment. You, you need a heirloom mace. You need a royal boots. You need uh, engineer's signet. You need commander's armor and a hol hollowed blade. So to make one ash cleaver. So to make one uh, blazing sun blade, you need one of these purples. I mean, one of each. So you need six purples total, and just one of each. And then to make bloody messenger, you just need four pieces of equipment. To make a foe slayer, foe slayers. These things are the easiest thing to make. All you need is a masterwork sword and a noble helmet. Um, so if I scroll down to a foe slayer, you can see. Uh, so ash cleaver. Sorry, before I get there, ash cleaver. Ash Cleaver, so I need a heirloom mace, I need royal guard boots, I need the mountain, I need engineer signet, which I already have one. Um, I think it's already included in this. I'll just leave it alone. And then the hollowed blade and the commander's armor, which I already have all of my commander's armors, so I do not need to craft any more to get the regal fletching. So I need a total of six, and I crafted all six of them. Um, also, royal grips, I have crafted all six, and a golden cu uh, caress, I have crafted all six. So I will not need those anymore. Uh, heart piercer, if you look at the heart piercer, I need eight heart piercers total. So that means I need uh, eight of these total. So I need eight mercenary long blades. I need uh, eight golden masks. I need eight instructors bows I need a masterwork falcon illumination and last resort so I need eight of each so if I look at um, the heart piercer I need eight of them so I got five of mercenary long blades already um, I have four golden masks I have five so I just need I'm about maybe 60 percent there 55 percent there maybe a little more and then let's see foe slayer let's keep going um, oh, bloody messenger. This is pretty easy to make. You only have you only need four things. So you need mercenary gloves, which I thought I already made them all. Mercenary gloves. I did not. Okay. So I still need uh, four more of these gloves. So I need to make four more of these gloves. I need uh, two more of these swords, and I'll be done. Masterwork sword. I just need two more masterwork spear. I need four of these. 
sorry, Sword of Monarch, I can't read. Sword of Monarch. I need all four of them, okay. So I still need lots of these. Okay, let's keep going to Blazing Sun Blade. So I need two of these Blazing Sun Blades. Um, so I have one already in storage. So I, but I need, yeah, I need two more. So that means I need two more of each of these. So I have one last resort already. So I just need one left, one more. Um, then I'll need a wolf band. I'll need these grips. I need that mercenaries long blade. Okay, Faux Slayer, this is where I was doing. See, it's super easy to make. All you need is just these two, these purple, two purple equipments, and you got yourself a, a, a Faux Slayer. And you need eight Faux Slayers. So uh, once you get all eight, uh, go ahead and work on the Heart Piercers, and you need eight Heart Piercers. Once you get the Heart Piercers, do the Bloody Messengers or whatever, and just try to get them all. Once you get six Ash Cleavers, uh, six blazing sun blades eight bloody messengers eight force layers and eight heart piercers you can then craft two eternal blazes two eternal howls and the butcher and once you have two of each you can craft the regard fletching so it's kind of like multi-step process but um it is uh it's worth it because in the end you will have what very few people have is the regal fletching which has really nice bonuses and if you have that um, people will definitely be scared of you okay so you look at these attack versus encounters those are really good when you when it's fully upgraded I think that there's like 150 150 percent plus you get the swordsman attack spearman attack and range attack uh, when fully upgraded I think it's all goes to 100 so you get 100 of each Plus, you get 150 of that. So, it, against encounters, this is a uh, this is a thing to use for sure. Okay, so that's my update. Uh, it's been seven minutes. I kind of hope this kind of makes sense to you. If not, um, I'm sorry. I really am. The par Paragon. I'm doing pretty good. I'm 43. I'm uh, I'm really trying to be patient to get to 50. I hope I hope it all works out. All right, well, I'll see you guys later. Um, I'll do, I hope this was a kind of good of a tutorial for you to where you can kind of get a head start and go ahead and start um, crafting some equipment. All right, well, I'll uh, see you guys later.